But there is a proverb which encourages us to, to put a, a blessing before wisdom. Right? And I've, I've taken that to heart, and especially at this point in my life, I think that my uh, calling or vocation at this point in my life is to offer plenty of blessing. And uh, I've, I found a uh, church home in Holland when I'm not preaching elsewhere, uh, I'm there. And I think my, my vocation here in this church is to bless this pastor, hmm. to find ways to be encouraging, to be available when that's needed. And then if she asks for my opinion about something, of course, I'm more than ready to uh, offer uh, my experience to her. But I, I think the starting point uh, must be the, the uh, offering of blessing. And the, I think young Younger, newer pastors are hungry uh, to receive a blessing. So I had, uh, I had a staff member in, in uh, my Zurich church who was a relatively new pastor. And I think he told me the first week how he wanted to be mentored. Right? Uh, he, he said, uh, I need to know what I do well. I said, okay. <laughs> and so I, I think I made it my... Uh, it made it my role in the relationship to say, you know, you're really good at that. I wish I had been as good as you are at that. So I think that's where the relationship uh, began. And then later, you know, he, I mean, he would occasionally ask me questions about what I thought about uh, certain situations, but that would not have been possible you know, had he not known that I really believed in him and his gifts for ministry. Mm -hmm.